biology, chemistry, astrology, and then I learned so many new things. Astrology? Astro astronomy. Yeah. <laughs> past uh, three days I've been experiencing different types of uh, science, biology, we had chemistry, we had physics, we also had topics of ethics, astronomy and um, I think the last one was computer science and it was pretty fun because some of the things I've never done before I get to experience without uh, the need of a lot of prior knowledge and it's great to be here to meet new people. We also got to know each other with uh, Science Frontier students and we got to work together which was very interesting and uh, <clears throat> we were able to like share ideas with them and I got to know like the ideas of Science Frontier students, Japanese students and how they think, how they, how they do things. The best thing about this uh, immersion camp was that we could learn from um, people who've been studying in a Japanese science school as well as um, international uh, teachers from other countries who've been studying in Tokyo University or Tsukuba University and that gave us a wide range of diversity and it was really interesting to see how um, especially in physics and chemistry because we have chemical symbols and formulas even though some of the Japanese students couldn't understand the teacher they could solve the questions because the formulas and the symbols are really international and that's what I enjoy the most. We did two or three labs. One of them was extracting a DNA from a banana by smashing it and then using ethanol and all these stuff. The movement of a pendulum, how different sizes or different mass changes or does not change the movement of a pendulum. And then there was another lab where we made litmus paper out of red cabbage and then we tested out different solutions to find out its pH level. The third day of the camp was like all devoted on the presentations, which I've never done, and I think it's a really good um, way of teaching people how to present well. We're doing one presentation as a class, and whoever gets the best in the class does, a, one, does it again in, in front of everyone in the school. I think what was most important was the ethics bit because it really made you think about what's in the future, what's more important. Some key terms were like being truthful, being um, conservative about private, private information, and other things as well. I, I'm really privileged to be attending this camp because I learned a lot of things which I didn't know before and I also got interested in many things which I thought I would never be interested in. I really have no idea what I'm going to be in the future right now so um, it was interesting because I could explore different subjects but not have to study them completely and um, take you know two years to learn about something I might not be interested in so it was good that I could have a range of subjects that I could try out and maybe they'll be my future group. <laughs> I wanted to study biology after St. Moore anyways, but after this Science Frontier experience, it, that, I wish it really got like more stronger. It, it got stronger. 